Hey everybody, my name is Phil Strazula. I am the founder of Select Software Reviews. Our mission is to help HR and TA teams to find and buy the right software through free online content like the stuff that you are consuming right now. HR chatbots was one of the first landscapes in the HR tech ecosystem that we actually looked at. We were excited about it then, years ago, and it really has not disappointed whatsoever. It has expanded. Something that used to be just sort of like a widget on a career site has become a really rich feature suite throughout a lot of these vendors. We've got other stuff in this web page like ROI calculators, pitfalls, questions asked on demos, etc., and of course, our list of the best vendors out there. This video is really gonna focus on the use cases for HR chatbots because I think that that is the most illustrative for why you should or should not be looking at this type of technology for your HR tech stack. Okay, so what do these things do? First off, they can help you source talent. They can look at a job rep, they can understand who you are probably looking for, they can crawl your databases like your ATS and your CRM or the open web, they can create short lists and then they can actually reach out to those short lists and say, hey, we're looking for a truck driver in this zip code or hey, we, you know, we saw you worked at Google for seven years as an engineer, we're looking for somebody who's an engineer, blah, blah, blah. Um, so sourcing, creating short lists, actually doing the outreach, the widget on the chatbot, and or, I'm sorry, the widget on the career site, and this could exist through text message, WhatsApp, really any sort of communication medium text-based still exists, and it can answer questions for candidates about culture, benefits, all that usual stuff people ask about. It can also screen people. So you source them, maybe for high volume, you put somebody into a chat bot and you ask some questions that are knockouts, right? Like, do you have a visa? Can you lift 50 pounds? Are you free to work on weekends, etc.? So you can actually do some screening as well as providing information to convert people in a higher rate into your ATS or CRM, or you can just move right over to scheduling. So let's say we get that Facebook engineer who's been there for seven years and we wanna put them on a recruiter's calendar. We can do intelligent scheduling. We can have multiple schedules. We can do all sorts of different complicated rule-based stuff or different personas that you are trying to recruit for. Somebody becomes an employee, they can go through the onboarding process through one of these bots. And when they become an employee, and sometimes, many times, this is actually the zone where you might get a different vendor. This is more recruiting chatbots. This is more maybe HR chatbots. Um, when somebody becomes an employee, they've got questions. They've got questions for IT, they've got questions for HR, and that's, takes up a lot of cycles from your team, the bot can answer more and more of those questions as time progresses about benefits, about PTO, all this stuff that employees are constantly sort of asking HR about. So really exciting category that start off in this like very sort of niche use case of increasing conversion rates on career websites and it was really good at that. And so these companies have grown and they've said, hey, we can do that, we can also do screening, we can also do sourcing, we can also do scheduling, et cetera. And my guess is that in not too long from now, we'll be doing another video, that's another update for this, about all of the other cool technology that these, these uh, vendors have added to their AI automation platforms. Again, Phil Strzula from Select Software Reviews, thanks for checking out our site. We've got lots of different ecosystems, anything from ATS to AI, everything in between, who are the best vendors, questions you should ask on demos, ROI calculators, pitfalls, everything you need to know to be an informed and successful buyer. Good luck, let us know how it goes, and if you like what you see here, please share it with your friends.